It's 85 years since Pluto was first discovered, and while once considered the ninth outer planet in our solar system, this has been downplayed over recent years as discoveries continue. But that didn't dilute the excitement of NASA scientists as they revealed the first images of Pluto sent home by their spacecraft. The New Horizons team is bringing what was previously a blurred point of light into focus. After 10 years and 5 billion kilometres, the New Horizons craft passed close to the dwarf planet on Tuesday before journeying out into the Kuiper belt that's full of icy spheres. But NASA has been astounded by the absence of craters on Pluto's surface and its high mountain ranges point to one thing. The steep topography means that those, the bedrock that makes those mountains must be made of H2O, of water ice. So we can be very sure that the water is there in great abundance. Uh, and actually models predicted that, but it's nice to see it driven home. Meanwhile, canyons on Pluto's biggest moon appear deeper than those on Earth. And so it, Sharon just blew our socks off when we had the new image today. So if we can pull it up so you can it's take there. a look at it. I don't, yeah. <laughs> the experts admit they're surprised that rather than being frozen, the evidence points to Pluto and its satellite being active internally.